Uh, you can see a little bit earlier this morning, I was getting so excited, I got completely tongue-tied because we really do have some superstars in studio this morning. Why? Because it's time for South African Marathon Runners to get excited. Today officially marks the 100-day countdown to the 2018 edition of the Cape Town Marathon as an IAAF gold label status race, which is massive. The Cape Town Marathon brings together some of the world's best marathon runners to take on the roads of the mother city. What a beautiful route. And as we look ahead to this year's marathon, we are joined this morning by race director Janet Wellam, as well as local marathon superstar Stephen Mokoka and Elana Mayer. Guys, welcome to the show. Thank you. Um, Stephen, you're looking at me with these eyes like you're about to start the race, <laughs> like it's there. Uh, you've got 100 days, man. Just, just uh, keep it calm. Now, this is, this is something to get excited about. Um, Janet, for you most of all, because so much goes into this, how important is that gold status? Talk us through why this is such a massive race on the, on e the international calendar, never mind just SA. Absolutely. Well, um, you know, the importance of gold is just so important to us. Um, our dream has always been to, to become the... The African major, um, that is a dream, and certainly uh, the, the first step, as we as we have always indicated, was gold. So, so gold label status is is imperative. Africa's only gold label status marathon. It's just phenomenal. We really are excited. Um, and it is one of the most beautiful runs to do, I think. But as someone who's been in that competitive field, you know, uh, this is a job for you. It's not about like the weekend warriors out there having these these wonderful milestones in their lives. Having that that gold label status for someone who is competing internationally, have it ratified by the IWF, this is massive, Ilana. Yeah, it's, um, you know, it, there's a lot of hard work going into the marathon. I always say, you know, um, you know, it's a lot easier being the athlete pitching up and run. Um, you know, it's an exceptional um, privilege for us to host, a, you know, wearing specifically gold uh, today. Uh, you know, pop, it is a, in that gold, <laughs> ladies, it's a, yeah. It's a gold uh, <laughs> label event, 100 days to go, uh, really excited. Um, Stephen, I mean, this must feel like a happy hunting ground for you. What are you expecting from the Cape Town Marathon this year? It, it is going to be an incredibly competitive field. How excited are you about the event? Firstly, thanks for having me. Secondly, thanks to Elana for inviting me. I'm very excited, actually. You know, most of the time we always run overseas. Then you have to travel far, for far, far, far. You get different time zones when you get there. But now I have to do it at home. So I'm very excited. My family will be able to watch me on TV, my friends, my supporters. I believe even here in Cape Town, I've got like young boys who always look up to me. So it will be a great opportunity for them to, to, to watch me. So I'm very excited. I, I mean, if I still get this excited to meet Alana, because I've, I've, I've seen you do some amazing things. You can imagine the power of a young athlete actually being able to go out there. But I've got to ask, how are you feeling? 100 days to go. Where's your, your headspace at? Are you going to win it? Uh, for me, I mean, yeah, I'm sitting with Ilana. We actually have to, we have to sit down and if you get good pacemakers, because the most important thing is for us to run a good time. So if they can run good pacemakers, I believe, I mean, marathon is a very long, long journey. I mean, you have to run like two hours. So if you get good pacemakers, you get good times. So in a marathon, I always advise people that you compete against the distance. Winning is a bonus. Um, we always think about winning when you just pass 30 kilometers, because before 30 kilometers, I mean, everyone is still fresh. So for me, I'm excited. <laughs> Everyone's when, still fresh. <laughs> yeah. Get out, man. Just get out. <laughs> yeah. So if we get good pacemakers, the most important thing is for, for, for us is to, to run a good time, So which, which, which I'm excited. I hope they can get a good field for, for pacemaking. And then um, for me, I will, I will be excited to go very hard. Just say yes, buddy. Just say <laughs> yes. I'm going to win it, man. <laughs> um, Janet, where, where can we follow the build-up to the event, find out all of those details? It is a massive event on our calendar, and Absolutely. I think a lot of... Capetonians especially want to come and be that guy standing screaming sure. on the sidelines. For sure. Um, obviously, all our social media platforms, CT Marathon, um, uh, Sunam Cape Town Marathon website, um, of course, that, that is a, a portal. Um, but along the route, um, you know, this year the route has changed, um, and we, we're going to be launching it in, 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 in about two hours' time. But I can give you a preview in the sense that um, we are not going into Pardon Island this year. So for all those poor people that had to go in there last year, We've changed it and we're going beachfront running um, a lot of the way. Wow. So we've included a whole six kilometer worth of beachfront running. Um, there's lots of spectator zones. Um, in fact, there are 22, um, which we will be announcing later on this afternoon. 
Um, and, um, and, and we're hoping that Cape Town can come out and, and, and support oh, us, well. you know. We're hoping that we can have the chias and, and showcase what South Africa can offer. Come wind, come rain, come Doesn't shine. Matter. We will be out there en masse. Thank you so much, guys. Stephen, Elana, Janet, thank you so much for, for joining us. Um, hopefully we'll have you back in a little bit closer to the event as well. Um, but this really is a massive opportunity, I think, for a top field, yes, but a lot of marathon runners are out there to prove themselves against the best. Hopefully we've got those pace setters out for you, Stephen.